Yo, what is going on guys? Welcome back to episode number 5 already of Minecraft Hardcore Survival. I always keep mentioning it in like a different way, like welcome back to Minecraft, welcome back to Minecraft Survival, welcome back to Survival, but welcome to Hardcore Survival, where a few things have changed since the last time I saw you guys. Uh, first off, we're going to eat a baked potato because we're running a bit hungry. There we go. But up here, I've already made a start on the roof. As you see, the, the, actually, oh, let me sleep first, right? I know I'm a bit unorganized, but I thought, let's jump on. So, new day, new dawn, da 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 I've made two layers of the roof already, and I'm thinking about putting cobblestone in here, which I think will actually look really, really nice. Uh, but what I wanted to do was just quickly put the remainder of the glass in. As you see... I was considering putting glass in the roof, but I sort of feel that that will make the house feel a bit too exposed with all of that, if that makes sense. Uh, probably won't to a lot of you, but to me, I feel we've already got enough gl glass um, coming along here, which will make the house look nice. So, targets and achievements for today's episode. So, uh, what I wanted to get done was the remainder of this glass. We're going to put the cobblestone in on the house roof as well as making the farm for the cows and the sheep and the pigs. So, first off, we need a bit more glass. And as you see over there, there is some sand, which I get in my eyes on. So, let's go have a quick gander at that. Actually, change plan. We're going to go get the stuff that we used for in the last episode, or the episode before that. Not too sure which episode we came over here and grabbed the sand. I think it was the last episode. Uh, we're just going to grab this. Before we get tied down, uh, we'll grab you as well. Ah, it's two bits. Ten, that should do it. You can see already. All right, mate, how you doing? Um, I'm just telling the viewers, you know, about the, our house we'll be building over there. Do you like it? Oh, you do like it? Okay, cool. Um, as you can see over here, the house just looks amazing right there. I actually do really love this house, and that's just why I'm a bit upset that if this world comes to a close, I'm going to be upset. I'm going to be real upset. But hey ho, we can just plow on. Hopefully it won't come down to any of that, but we just got to take caution. As long as we take caution, we'll be fine. We'll be absolutely fine. So, this is the bit I always forget how to do. So, let's make ourselves some sticks. I always do this in the wrong way. So, what I'm going to do this time is... Yep, I did it the wrong way. Oh well. Um, we've got three sets of animals... So we need three sets of everything. Well, actually, we need as many fences as we can get. So, put that in there, and then you put that like that, and like that, and then you put that in there, and then you put that like that, and uh, there you go. <laughs> you get yourself some fences. So I haven't actually lost my mojo too much. I have lost it a bit, but we can still make things. So that's, that's a bonus. I still have that wooden pickaxe, so I don't really know what I'm going to do with it. Uh, let's just do that like that. Let's get that over. Anyhow, it's going to be the same amount, so that'll do for now. Oh, oh I didn't mean to do that. Oh well. Uh, what I might do in like future episodes is make some more wood. I say make, go out and graft for it, and then we should be sorted. So, there we go. What we're going to do is we're going to come up here. Do I have any more wood? Not enough to do those that what I was going to do. So, first off, we're going to need dirt. And we're going to need a lot of it. As we're going to smooth out this layer. Yeah, this layer will do. So, which is what we're going to do. This is the idea. This is the plan. This is the hoe down. This is the way forward. This is going to be area number one. Now, area number one is going to hold, I believe, cows, maybe? Or sheep, one of the two. We need it to hold an animal that we can't generate too much from. Doing, 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 doing. Right, I say we make it th up to here, three wide. This could take a lot longer than I thought it would. But it's all about making starts in life, isn't it? We've got to get ourselves, we've got to get our mojo, we've got to, we've got to do the ting to make the ting. If the ting's a ting. You know, man's got a ting ting from a ting ting. Man from barking. 
you watch the side man, you'll know that reference. But yeah, so we are making gains. We are making big gains, and this is what we're gonna do. So great. Of course, it's me that doesn't have enough. Let's get five and see what we can do with that. Come on, come on, come on. Boom, five. Two, three, four. All right, I need four. We are going to need all of our equipment. And we're going to put the first gate here. And then build around it. I am damn excited for this. I really am. Let's pull this back a bit. We don't really need this. And it just gives us a bit more room to play with when it comes to our animals. Yeah, all right, Jerry, no need to, you know, bar at me. All right, there we go. The good thing is, uh, you might think this is a bit tight so far, but it was when it expands this way, you would see a big more, you know, room to play with. But this is just going to be our first pen. You know, we're going we're gonna to have several pens, uh, like maybe like dot one over there and maybe one over here, just for animals. Just so we, we got a rough idea of what we're going to need it for. So, first off, mandatory thing, put your torches down as it's hardcore. We do not want to have ourselves buggered, <laughs> in simple terms, because of mobs coming and killing our, our farm. So, first things first, getting all the deeds done, all the good stuff, and yeah. I want to know, guys, that's one thing for you guys in the comments I was thinking about the other day. How many people thought we wouldn't get to episode 5? That'd be That's an interesting question. Do you think do you think we would have got to episode 5 or we wouldn't? Because I personally, if I'm being brutally honest with myself, didn't think we would get that far. Because, you know, it's me. I don't play Minecraft like at a competitive level of any, or anything like that. The fact that like I play for fun. And, yeah, I'm just happy with designing things and making things how I want them to be. So, uh, let's go to our chest and we're going to get out some... What does sheep take? Wheat as well, don't they? But what I want in there, I want cows in that in this first one because cows are going to be the most efficient one for me. So, I believe, if I'm correct... Hello, Doris. Um, in my travels... of I've been on many travels in my lifetime. Uh, let's get rid of you. Just then we got the cows got a way to get through. And me in the future, if I want to build anything. I believe this way, uh, we did see a cow somewhere. Doris, there's wolves. Why am I seeing everything other than a cow? All right, come on. Doris? Hello, Doris. Who you guys seen Doris? There's a sheep. There's Doris. Man like Doris, she was out in the open the whole time. Oh, two Dorises. Even better. Come on, come with me. Come on. We got work to do. We're big boys. We got work to do. Come on. Come, 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 come. Come, 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 come. The good thing is, once we have these, at least, there's three cows here in total. So when we at least have three, uh, we'll be able to then start killing random ones and things like that because we know our farm will be fine. Doris, come with me. Come with me. Come on. Oh, no, not Jeffrey. Jeffrey, mate, come on, leave me alone. Not now. Right, this could work one or two ways. No, it's not going to work like that. All right, come with me. Both of you. We'll kick you out, Jeffrey, in a minute. Come on. Keep going. Come on. Come in, come in, come in, come in, come in. Yeah. That's how you do it. All right, I'll be back in a minute. All right, let me go get your friend. Let me go get your friend. You know you want a friend. Uh, is there three others? Dang, there's a lot of cows here, actually. Uh, let's go with you. You look advertising. Come with me. No. Yep, 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 yep. Come on. Come, 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 come. As Seneca likes to say. Alright, we're actually making gains on this series. I know, like, every single episode I say, wow, we're doing this or we're doing that, but I'm loving this so far. We're actually making proper gains. <laughs> well, eventually, we're going to need a lot of um, wood to be able to make a lot of chests for food and things like that. Because we're going to need it eventually, but for now, we're just making the basics. And this is going to be an XP grinder for us as well. Boom. You two, mate. Yay, there we go. The parrots and the bats. See, that's just the birds and the bees reference. There we go. 
We now have our farm in full motion. Well, it's not fully in motion. Uh, excuse me, because you know we have to make the sheep one, which I think I'll make there. And then I think, do I want to make, do I want to make the pig one over there, or is that going to be a bit too out of the way? Um, I think what we could do. I know I just keep doing random things in this world, but uh, what we're going to do is because we work coming out of here. If we make the pig farm here. Uh, we're going to make this three wide, I feel, when it comes down to it. Just like this. And then this will be our pig enclosure. As you can see, there's pigs over there, actually. So this could actually work out very well in our favour. Uh, but yeah, what we're going to have to do at some point, I might do this on camera, is just get rid of all of this stuff, because we're not going to need it. And then we'll be able to go ahead and start the pig farm because everybody loves pigs don't they right <laughs> right guys because <laughs> you know you get pork bacon and all that good stuff that's all the good stuff we love to eat so let's just get rid of the majority of this as we can what i'm trying to do is i'm not trying to do too much off camera and give you guys an insight of what i do but at the same time i don't want to bore you guys with like the the meaningless things of uh doing things this if that makes sense. I don't think it does, but well. That should be enough for now. Then what we'll do, oh yeah, this is actually going to look really cool. Uh, we will have it like that, and then we'll have the gate coming out like there and there. But for now, we'll just put that there. I like that. Alright, this is going to look mint once it's done. I'm just going to take some of this. I'm sorry. I'm going to take all of this so it just doesn't look out of place too much. There we go. And then what I'm going to do is I'm going to put the rest of this down. Like so. And then... Like that. Like that. Alright, this is actually starting to look really nice. This is really starting to look really nice. Right, I think what we're going to do is we're going to head off to bed. I think that would be the best idea for us now. Put that on there. Yeah, I'm loving this so far. The cows are happy. I hope they're happy, actually. Was that enough light? I forgot to check. Perfect amount of lighting. Um, the pigs are going to be over there. I'll be able to watch them from afar. And then we're going to have the sheep, which are already down there. There. So let's get head back into our house. Uh, get some sleep. And then go from there. We've already got a lot of coal. Cobblestone, sorry. That we can use for the roof. Uh, let's see how much we can put on. Get on. Get on. There we are. Uh, let's see. Let's go to our cobblestone and put in as much as possibly. I don't think we'll get it all done. I really don't think so. But we might get the majority of it done, which is what we're after. Let's get rid of you. Just like this. Ah, beautiful, beautiful. Yeah, obviously we weren't gonna do it, I knew that. But it just gives you uh, like an insight of what uh, the roof's gonna look like. I think it'll look really, really nice in the end. So. What was next on our agenda? We had an agenda, and I can't remember the agenda. But we did finish off the glass. We're finishing the roof. Let's go in here and see if you guys are ready to, you know, get it on again. Are you ready? Oh, you, st you guys are still tired. Damn. They were they were getting on, like, proper. If you don't get that, those, that what I'm saying about, then you're, you're too young. You're too young, you're too young. Right then, so. Uh, let's go about putting things in their rightful places. Actually, actually, I was losing my mind a bit there. We can use this stuff that we weren't really going to use for much as chests. Ta-da! Now, what we can do is have two basic ones like that. Uh, we'll have like a chest, like a chest here and a chest there. Oh, this is going to look cool once it's all done. And then possibly one like there. And then we'll come upstairs. We will have a chest here. And then we'll have one there for the the other side of the cabinets. And we'll like, use these as like cabinets of like all the important stuff that we need. As there won't be as many mobs up here. Uh, here sorry. So we'll be out here. So. Balcony time. This is what it's going to start to look like. 
for now, uh, we'll put you there. And then obviously once we have enough, we will put another one here. Now I think this is going to look mint once it's done. If you can imagine, like, you come out, uh, you like, uh, let's just imagine. You, you're in bed, you get out of bed, you go, ah, oh, oops. Just going to go have a quick look outside. So you open your door, imagine this, that's there. And you just look across, you can see Gary, you know, your neighbour. Gary? Where the hell's Gary? Jeffrey, mate, you seen Gary? Alright, I guess, um, everyone's out, I guess. And you can, like, you can come out here, you can have a look at your, your pigs, which is going to be at some point. And then I can come down here, and I'll be able to see my, my cows, my sheep, and everything like that. I'm just trying to think of other animals that we're going to need. Uh, maybe donkeys, but I don't think you can breed donkeys, can you? Well, that, from not what I know, anyway. Uh, I know for a fact you can't... Was it someone else? I forget what it was. Um, Alright, let's, so, let's do some organisation, because organisation is key. I want to keep all of the food stuff in here, I feel. So let's take all of this out of here. And what we're going to do, we're going to organise this slightly by putting things in two orders. So, as seeds make wheat, these two can go together. Carrots are carrots. Everybody loves a bit of a carrot. Whoops, there we go, like that. Uh, eggs, things like that can go down the middle. More seeds. Let's go like that. Uh, eggs go down there. Seeds go there. That goes there. Oh, that can go there, and Bob is your uncle. So, we will use this one as a bit of a crap chest that we use for things various that we really don't need or ever going to use, but we just want to get out of our infantry for now, which is going to be this stuff. And obviously, we're going to use arrows at a later stage, and we're going to use the bones for bone meal at a later stage. But, oh, we've got seeds. Damn, we got a lot of seeds. But we did take a lot from the village, didn't we? Um, the saplings. Oh, no, the flint we don't need at the minute. Uh, is there anything else? Dirt, we need, we need, we need, we need, we need, we need. We do not need the books. But I'll put that for now. But what I want to do is get some saplings. And what we're going to do is we're going to put these sort of up here, there, possibly there, here, 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 and here, and here. So hopefully that will like, make it look quite woody. I know I was like on about, wow, I love the view and everything like that. But... The woody look, I think, is quite nice, but we're going to need to put a lot more torches down to stop mobs from coming and kicking out our ass. Which we don't really want to happen, but it happens. But, I think that's a nice way to end off the episode. What we're going to do is we're going to quickly eat. Because who does not love a bit of baked potato? There we go. Job is a good one. So, what have, we, what have we achieved in this episode today, guys? Ooh, egg. Egg. Gimme, gimme, gimme. Thank you. We have achieved... Putting in the rest of the glass at the top there with the roof that is nearly finished. But we're getting there. Then the house will be complete as a building. And then we'll just be furnishing the outside of the... Yeah, the outside and the inside of just things that we're going to need. What we've also done is we have put in our cows. We've got Jeffrey and Liz over there. They got it on and they made Brian. And yeah, we're going to... In the next episode, we're hopefully going to start our farm, which is down there. As also putting in the sheep and the pig that we've already started. Uh, all their stuff in. But yeah, we've achieved quite a bit today, and I'm really, really happy we've done it. So, if you guys have enjoyed this episode and you want to see some more of it, then want to hit that subscribe button to be alerted of when I next upload, and it also helps me out a lot just to know you guys love my content. Also, hit the like button to show your support towards me, and whether you like the series or not, hit that dislike button if you didn't, and leave a comment as to why. But yeah, until then guys, I hope you guys have a brilliant day or evening, or sleep if you're going to go to bed. But until then, guys, I'll see you later. Peace.